shackles, chains, dozens of criminal undocumented immigrants deported back to their home countries. These are the worst of the worst here that are, that are being removed. Leonard DeSanti with Immigration Customs Enforcement says chartered flights like these out of Pennsylvania happen roughly twice a week. Why did you come to this country? You know, we got a better opportunity. Alfonso Rodriguez Orostico tells me he came to the U.S. roughly 15 years ago. He was arrested in our area twice for a DWI, released both times without serving any time. And no, ICE didn't pursue him. We have limited resources, and we try and focus those limited resources on, uh, on the most dangerous criminals. However, ICE recently picked him up at his work site in Landover, Maryland, when it found Orostico was wanted for murder in Mexico. He'd been running from the law for nearly 20 years. Do you know anything about charges for aggravated homicide in Mexico? No. <laughs> his story later changes. In 1995, were you involved in an aggravated homicide? Uh, not really. He boards the flight and is seated in this row alone. Orostico and several others will make the flight down to Brownsville, Texas. From there, they'll cross over the Mexican border and immediately be taken into police custody. What we're seeing here is, is a dangerous criminal alien who not only has committed crimes in this country, but is also wanted for uh, a crime in his own country. Hours later, the men are back in Mexico to face the justice system there. Erica Gonzalez, News 4.